The Words of This Life with Apostle Grace Lubega. It's expedient that we learn to equip saints for the work of ministry to the edification of the body. God has called you and I to produce results. It's the only way we can multiply. If we don't produce results, each one of us, we cannot multiply. God is killing this whole mindset of I have to go to the man of God. The church is changing in a sudden transition as the world is. And we are going to come to a point where men just come in the presence of God to be sharpened because he prophesied in the scriptures that one day all will be healed. I see a time in life and I know many of you are starting to feel it. But we are going to get to a point where everybody in the meeting is healed. Everybody in the meeting is blessed. Their finances are okay. Their marriage is fine. Everything is okay. Now at that particular point, what do we do? Are you hearing me? There has to be something deeper than a job, deeper than marriage, deeper than a car, deeper than healing, deeper than that. That is the only way we can equip saints for the work of ministry. Whether I'm an apostle, I have a responsibility to that. Whether I'm a prophet, I have a responsibility to that. Whether I'm a teacher, I have a responsibility to that. Whether I'm an evangelist, whether I'm a pastor, business person, wherever you are, you have due responsibilities. God gives you and I a portion. And there's a place of yielding and responding and receiving it. Every man must know their part in the gospel. You might not be on the pulpit, but you have a part. You might not be a worshiper, but you have a part. But no man can have a part in this gospel if he does not have a certain honor for the word. How do you begin your day? You begin it with a devotion or something. Read the word. Feel yourself. Read the word and speak in tongues. The first thing when you wake up, you check your Bible or devotion. Before you even brush your teeth, you read it. Speak things out of there. And out of speaking it, you start brushing your teeth. You're speaking in tongues, but you're brushing. The Bible says, he he sent a word unto Jacob and it led the all of Israel. Do you understand what I'm saying? Man, you wake up in the morning and look at the Bible and read something and then it stirs you up. Why? Because the word of God can turn you into anything. That's why we are mad with the word. That's why we preach every Thursday. We don't just pray for you. We teach you. Why? Because we want you to come out of, of the meeting with a path. Don't just be healed in the body. Be healed in your spirit also. Be encouraged in your soul. Be re-energized to your cause. Go out with a purpose. Lose appetite and sleep. Tell God, what did you call me to do?